Tell me something you would have told the younger you. Okay, I'll go first. When I first started out, I remember sitting in my tiny apartment and saying to my friends, if all I could ever earn in my life was £500 a week, I would be the happiest girl alive if I could make that money through music. Of course, you fast forward in hindsight is always 2020, right? Now I look back and I think one of the things I would have loved to have had available to me as a young artist was some sort of financial planning, someone to help me with all the money that we earn as artists and how to keep hold of that money. For example, when you sign a record deal, no one tells you when you're like 18 that every single thing that you get in that record deal, like your videos, the cars picking you up, someone who gets you lunch, it's all paid for out of your royalties. So someone to give me good, solid advice when I was an artist would have been amazing and especially financial advice. And the same I would tell anybody now, put your money in bricks because they're not making any more beach. (laughs) That's just my opinion anyway. So financial planning is something I definitely would have told myself. Secondly, I would have said nothing lasts forever. I remember the younger me in my little apartment thinking I was absolutely bulletproof at like 14, 15, 16. I thought I was bulletproof right up until I got shot. (laughs) Not literally, but figuratively speaking, you know, and and that really was a shock to me to realise like, oh, maybe I can't make music forever. Maybe the talent runs out. Maybe it goes away because sometimes you get writer's block. I had it for 10 years with drum and bass and um, I've only just found my rhythm again now. You know, I couldn't make it to save my life. It's really crazy, the things that we take for granted, our health, um, when we're young, that we can do anything. And again, the last piece of advice I give anyone, if you're young, go out there and do everything whilst you've got the brass monkeys to go and do it, whilst you've got the cojones to do it, do it all. Because when you're older, you're so much more cautious and you've been knocked about a bit by the world and you've got sharp edges and, you know, people can cut themselves on you. So when you're young, soft and impressionable and still clay is a good time to go out there and live your life fearlessly, like nothing could happen to you. I love that. So that's what I would tell myself. What would you tell yourself? Share in the comments. Love and face your girl. Mwah.